Yo, what's happening, guys? It's Tony here, and today we are here with our preseason game, one of our three preseason games for the NCP, the oh, the National Competitive Nimbus Pokemon something another. Oh, I don't remember what it's called. Then the National Competitive Pokemon Nimbus or the NCP Wi-Fi Season One. God, I that's terrible. I couldn't remember it. Um, but yeah, we are here. We are going against Silver Smasher, aka, uh, that's his name, Silver Smasher. I am out of it, bro. Coach of the 40 and Typhlosion. I have not done a league match or a video in a fat minute. Um, as you can hear, though, we got fucking audio. We got game, in game audio. So that's pretty dope. Pretty excited for that. Um, I was really in the mood for some league matches. So after the we finish drafting, I hit up my the three opponents who I would not be facing in the regular season. And I said, "No, hey, would you all like to do some off or some preseason games?" All of them said yes. So here's the first one of the three against once again, like I said, Silver. Um, I definitely didn't do as extensive as prep as I would a normal game because you know it's preseason. But you know I'm still gonna try nonetheless to win. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. I was gonna quickly run through the month before the match just to let you guys know what we're going on with. Um, and let me just say we brought some heat. First off, we got Ariana Grande. I decided to nickname the theme for this season would just be a bunch of artists that I listen to. So, um, first off, we got Ariana Grande, our Mega Diancy, the Quiet Clear Body with Moonblast Earth Power Explosion and Trick Room. I decided for this week I would bring Trick Room against Silver, or not this week, but this game I would bring Trick Room versus Silver. I thought Trick Room looked really, really nice versus him. So I decided I'd bring that. Moonblast and Earth Power were the only two moves I really needed uh, to hit his team. His team and my team should both be on the screen in case it is not, and just because I, I want to, I'm going to read off our team right now. My team consists of Z Latios, Milotic, Porygon 2, Crocodile, Z Ninetales, Vileplume, Mega Diancy, Mandibuzz, Delmize, Magnezone, and Chinchino. Whereas Silver is rocking out with the Z Salamence, the Raikou, the Shaman, the Vaporeon, the Hitmonchan, the Statlin, the Mega Gardevoir, the Heatbrand, the Hippowdon, the Magneton, and the Zatu. So Moonblast and Earth Power hit everything on his team for as much as I could, and Explosion is just kind of there because uh, I didn't have a fourth move. And Trick Room, obviously, to get the Trick Room off because um, I thought Trick Room looked really nice against his team. Although his team is very, very fast, so I thought this would catch him off guard. But obviously, every team, if you're going to run Trick Room, you probably want multiple Trick Room users. So, for a second one, we got Rich Brian here, our Porygon 2, um, with the Trace, if you light, Ice Beam, Shadow Ball, Recover, and Trick Room. I thought those two moves, uh, Ice Beam and Shadow Ball, really hit a lot of his team pretty hard. The only Mon I really see having a problem hitting is the Hippowdon. Obviously, Recover so we can get back up to full and Trick Room so we can set it up. Um, the reason I ran Trace was for Salamence, getting off the Intimidate might be nice. Shaman, getting the, um, Natural Cure off, in case he toxics me, that might be nice. The Vaporeon's Water Absorb, if I can come in on it, Scalding, it'd be nice. Um, pretty much it. Really none of the other abilities. It gets Heat Ran as well, uh, would be nice. Um... For with its flash fire, although I can't really hit the the heat ram with this thing. But yeah, next, and this is I believe a spadef wall. Sassy, yeah, that's spadef. Um, next we got our Denzel Curry, the crook dial with the brave Moxie life orb. I decided to run Moxie over Intimidate just because really the only physical attackers are Salamence and Hit Munch, and there's only two I'm really afraid of. And although I was really scared of Salamence, I decided I would just uh, prefer Moxie. Um, earthquake knockoff, throat chop, and stone edge. Earthquake and knockoff, obviously, for our main two stabs. Throat chop for the Mega Gardevoir's Hyper Voice. That'd be some heat to get off. And stone edge for the Salamence. Uh, next, we got Milotic, the Weekend, Ice Beam, Toxic Cave, Recover, just a Fizz Death Wall. We got Brockhampton, our Magnezone with the Modest Magnet Pull with the Assault Vest, Thunderbolt, Flash Cannon, Hidden Power, Ground, and Volt Switch. Versus his entire team and in terrain, it's really nice. 
Also offers a secondary Mega Gardevoir switch in outside of Porygon 2. And lastly, we got Kanye West or Amanda Buzz. I know it's female, but I, want, I need to include Kanye in there somewhere. It's Death Wall, Foul Play, Taunt, Roost, and Defog. Uh, meant to counter really just the Shaman and the Heat Ran because I didn't really have a switch in for that. And I guess the Zatu as well. I think we're bringing it against Silver. I shall see you guys in the battle. Okay, we are now challenging Silver right now. Oh, this will be fun. Um, yeah, I really haven't uploaded any leagues recently because I just, I took a break from YouTube. I had the end of school starting up, so everybody had to focus on other things, and I thought, I felt like school, or I felt like editing and recording was more of a, um, more of a job than a hobby. So I kind of took a break from it, but recently I've been in a big, big mood um, to record and stuff. So we're going to see how long the, um, I la I don't know. I'm going to try my best to upload this league in its entirety. Um, but, we'll, you know, we'll try our best. We'll see what happens. Um... Let me open up Discord because I do actually need to wish my good man GLHF. Um, what music do we want? We of course want the Necrozma theme to the best theme in all the Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. Uh, if I can find it, there you go. Okay. Already wish him good luck, have fun. He's selecting his mod. We had to put our team in our party as well. Um. Just for to say it again, good luck on fun silver. Obviously, this league matter doesn't matter too much. Um, but you know, we're just gonna have fun. That's what matters. Um, I guess I should add this since so we're just kind of sitting here. Um, silver is not bringing you know the complete set. That he wanted just because his Jenner, aka Mr. Australian Kurt, was a big, big, big meanie. So, and regarding him as mom before he went out. So, um, Silver, I believe, is just rocking out with, um, regular mods. Or, he's still gonna bring six of his actual mods on his team with, for the most part, the correct moves. It just it's not gonna have the same exact spread as he wants so we definitely have a little bit of an advantage over him but nonetheless hopefully it all works out hopefully they're at least like battle ready Pokemon they're not just like random mods he caught in the wild um but yeah so he ended up bringing the Raikou the Mega Gardevoir the, the Powdon the Shaman, the Salamint, which is Z, and I believe Heatran is also his Z user. Let me double check that real quick. Uh, yes, it is. I don't need to keep track of kills. I just want to keep track of his movesets. So, thing to keep in mind, Hippowdon and Shaman are the only two that don't get two-shot by Mega Diancy. My Ludic is my Hippowdon. Partially my Heat Ran. He's got that Heat Ran set first. and But mainly the Hippowdon and Salamence switch ins. My Raikou switch in is definitely fucking Porygon 2. Mega Guard switch in Porygon 2. Um, we're going to lead off with our. I guess we'll lead off with. Are Brock Hampton? Um, I don't see a too big of a problem with leading with their Magnezone. Uh, good luck, have fun though, like I already said, Silver. Um, so, my Raikou switching to either the Magnezone or. We're going to Magma Guard switch in, same thing. Hip out on switch in. Okay, he's gonna go into Shaman. I don't want the Shaman to have Earth Power. 
Um, so we're gonna switch out here immediately into our Spadef Mandibuzz. And we're gonna see what he does here. He's gonna seed me. And he's gonna miss. Epic. Alright, um, we're gonna taunt here. He missed to outspeed us. There's a very good chance to outspeed us, actually. I don't think I have any speed in this Mandibuzz. I don't know why I would. So, uh, we'll see what happens here. He's gonna seed me again. Okay, so this is a defensive shaman. Okay. Um. What does he go into here? I don't see a problem in foul playing here. You know, withdraw. Go into his pout on. We could taunt this thing. How much are we gonna do? About twenty percent. Use leftovers. Um, is that like ninety-five percent now? Um, he is leftovers and. Shaman has a leech. Let's see. Um. We're gonna taunt here before. No, I don't think he. Why would he go into this? If I. He dialed speed. I taunt him. He can't set up rocks. He can't yawn. He can't. He can't do anything to me. I'm gonna taunt. Okay, he's gonna withdraw. I guess to bait the taunt. Into Rosalina, I assume I pick a guard. Just find that's me. That means he's not gonna be subbing or anything. So he's not gonna be sub or anything. Or calm mind, or at least he can't sub or calm mind. Okay. Um. Does Gardevoir get two shot? By one sec, I'm trying to close this tab real quick. Um, and nothing floated, so this is probably from NTR right now. Um, I want to know if I can just go into Magnezone here. Okay, if I go into P2, set up the trick room. What does he go into on P2? I guess it would be Heat Ran. From there. Don't really have the greatest switching. But Magnuson could just full switch. Um. Mandibuzz versus. What is that mod called? Um. Hip Houdon? Okay, so he's a mixed wall. Magnezone is not doing a lot. So I'm gonna go into Rich Brian. Which is Gardevoir doing with the uh, Focus Blast? Wow, and that's a soul fest too? Damn, I should have done the calcs on that. I should have ran Choppel instead of whatever it's called. I got the overcoat now though. That means the sand isn't gonna buffer me. That's cool. It's gonna hyper voice me. Jeez, bro. So glad I don't have to face this in the regular season. Porygon 2. I got some max spadef. I'm still fucking taking so much. Two fairies probably modest, I'd assume then. 
Yeah, if he did 35, that's a modest card of one in like a high roll. Uh. Focus Blast doesn't kill. Shadow Ball does a lot, but. I'm gonna set the Tricker. And withdraw. Going to Heat Ran. I'm gonna set the Trick Room. We do not want to get Toxic, Trap, whatever. We don't have Scald on our Milotic. Okay, that is actually a big old problem. That is a big old problem. Is our Crooks low enough for the Eat Ram? Uh, I'm gonna scout because I don't want him to go for the Z Solar Beam on the Melody Prediction. But in the sand, that doesn't affect it. I should, he should be faster than me. Okay, he's gonna go into Moto Moto. That's good. Sandstorm's gonna be gone now. Um, so we are going to go into... We're just gonna stay in an ice beam. Do a good amount. He's gonna set up his rocks. <coughs> What's he going into here? Heat ran. Let me turn to trick him to do that. That one turn. I'm just gonna stay in an ice beam. Can withdraw. Do you want to fucking heat ran? Damn it. Should have clicked it. Oh well. Should have gone to click. The thing is, he would have wanted to shame and like hurt me. I don't know how safely we can go into um, whatever it's called. Our mandibuzz. Nice. Death drop. It's gonna lava plume us. I don't know how much it's gonna do. Two forty-two HP. Okay. Here goes our thing. Mean that I think we could probably trick room here, recover, and then go into Mandibuzz and Bruce and get up, uh, get away rocks and all that shenanigans. That's what we're gonna do. He's gonna switch out into Raikou, so this is good. Kind of. This is like sub calm mind or something. That's kind of a problem. So do we go hard crook then? I think he's gonna call mind or sub. So I'm gonna go into Dinzoker. I'm gonna go into hard crocodile. If he or spheres, then fuck. But I don't see him. He knows we're Spadef. He's gonna Volt Switch. That's that's fine. Um We're gonna knock off here. Are we? Yeah, we'll knock off. I think Shaman comes in. I don't think. Yeah, I don't think he's gonna predict, over predict or anything like that. 
Alright, how much are we doing to this shaman? This is an adamant life orb knockoff, bro. Half. Uh, knockoff. 80 versus knockoffs, like. There's like 1.5, so 65 times 1.5. I don't think we kill. Ninety-seven. Yeah, so we don't kill the throw chop. Um I guess we'll swap here. We get these rocks away right now, actually. We'll go do that. He's probably just gonna go for the synthesis, yeah. So like I could have stayed in and throw chopped, but like he was healing more with the synthesis than I was doing with the throw chop. So in the end, it really wouldn't have mattered too much. We should have speed here though and get the defog off. If we just weaken the shaman, fucking. Whatever it's called, Crook looks really, really nice. Okay. I think we still have one more room at Return of Trick Room. Nope, there's Trick Room ended. Um. We're just gonna go into Brockhampton. This fucking Gardevoir is scary, man. I didn't realize how much focus blast was doing. I wish I put on Chopper instead. The assault vest. Gonna hyper voice us. Jesus, dude. All right. Um. What does he do here? I think we can just go for the flash cannon. I don't think we have anything to be scared of. Actually, you know what? He ran probably outspeed us. Oh, he can't go Reku. Okay. Meaning I don't think he has focus class, just based on how he's playing this. But no damage, bro. Um, he's probably gonna or no, he doesn't have or sphere. He's not a uh, shiny. I'm gonna volt. That may HP ground. Gonna volt switch. What's he going to? My guess would be Moto Moto. If you go see Ram, that's fucking amazing. But I just feel like he's gonna go Moto Moto. Brasidia. It's not doing anything. I'm okay with letting this thing go down, my Magnezone. I'm completely fine with letting this thing go down, if that means that this thing is stupid weak. Shaman versus my Magnezone. How much are we doing with, uh, his own? How much are we doing with the Flash game? Not a lot. We are doing not a lot. And my capture card from the throat, and that's pretty cool. NTR, not even capture card. NTR, what are you doing, bro? Alright, he's gonna be frozen for a second. That's uh, not very cool, but it is doing that. Um, I'm gonna try something. And we de-seed. Yo, what's up, guys? We are back. Um... Had to recreate on Showdown because we tried recreating again on Wi-Fi, but there was a DC right when we got finished. Um, we did get a couple turns off after I hit powered as he wanted to Shaman. I went to my Mana Buzz on his Earth Power, and then from there he seated me as I went for the Taunt. Um, we're caught up now, though. Um, I think I'm just going to Roost here because I am kind of getting weak. I'm going to go Gahardivore. Um This is very much a problem. I don't think I really need Magnezone, so I think I'm really just gonna go sack it. 
I'm gonna go Diane scene set up the trick room. Uh power on that seventy. I feel like Okay, cool, it's not gonna load my damage truck. There we go. Okay, come on. I got you. Come on, computer, you got it. Um I feel like Diancy just outspeeds fucking hit powered on just cause it's just so slow. Yeah, okay. Then we'll go into Brockhampton here, we'll sack it. As the hyper voices, um I'm gonna just flash can he probably just gonna kill me here. I hope so at least. I'm gonna volt switch on the off chance he he does some kind of swap. Yeah, he's just gonna kill me. I'm gonna go into Diancy here. I'm not gonna set up the trick room just yet. I'm just gonna go for the moon blast. Just cause that hurts his team. Shaman is pretty weak. Uh, that's actually at 88. Who knows? Maybe we can kill. The nickname. Oof. Um. <laughs> god, I should have fucking muted spectators. <laughs> oh my god. All right. Um. <laughs> <laughs> um, but it should be good. I feel like I could do a KO hip I'm not gonna do the calc. I really don't care enough to do the calc. Um, I'm not gonna set the trick room because if he goes to pout on, then fuck. Dude, nothing really wants to come in on me, anyways. Yeah, he's gonna go hippo here. Uh, we're gonna mega evolve here. We're gonna get off the moon blast. We're gonna do a shit ton. Jesus Christ. Let's go. Um, we're gonna moon blast another time. And we're gonna take up the hip out on. That's cool. That's great. I mean, no rocks. Don't have to deal with that anymore. I mean, that mana buzz is definitely more expendable now. So then go in the Yeet Ran here. I feel like this Yeet Ran probably outspeeds me. Um, oh my god, everything's just moving. Yeah, probably. Uh, can I please? There we go. He only needs a little bit of speed investment, but I really don't want to risk that. I really don't. Let's go into Manda Buzz and he's gonna go into this. We're gonna double we're gonna switch I mean out into P2, I guess. Oh, we could get rid of this burn actually with this. Mmm. He went to just kinda sitting there. Although we underspeed everything on team now with Diancy and whatever the other mod's called. Um, we're gonna cover here because we don't want to risk. Because we need this thing uh, a lot higher of health. We're gonna trick room here. And then. Oh! I didn't know the thing gets caught. Uh, gets taunt. We're gonna go into Melodic here, as he toxics. I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna watch for the Z move. Uh, that was not the what I intended to do, but totally meant to do that. Um, we're gonna go back out in the Porygon, try to. We're just gonna set up the trick room right away. We're not gonna, you know, swap in anything else. Or we're not going to go hard to cover first. We're just going to set the trick room right away. Um, we're going to trick room here. He's going to go into Gardevoir here. We recover. Uh, do we recover? I really want to sack this thing. And what's his Shaman at? Is that full? Fuck. How much did Shaden take earlier with the knockoff? 65 from a Crocodile. Can Crocodile versus the Shaman? Can I just two a KO with? I did sixty five. It said right with a knockoff. Okay. Maybe has a little bit of HP. No, not at all. Um, throw shot. 
to it should to a KO. So I'm gonna let myself go down here. Maybe a mistake. Probably will be a mistake. We're just gonna let ourselves go down here. We're gonna get off the Shadow Ball. We're gonna get the Spadef drops. It doesn't really matter. We're gonna go into our Crooked Down. We're gonna get a bunch of turns here. We're gonna get three turns. Should be able to pick up KO on something here. It's gonna go into Shaman here with Throat Chop. It could do exactly half. Damn, if he had stayed in Hyper Voice, dude, that would have been fucking heat. That would have been great. He didn't, though. Um, we're gonna throw a trap here, though. And now he's in a really, really bad position. Cool, we got the roll. We're gonna get the Moxie boost. And we got one more turn. So we are probably gonna pick up the KO on anything. My guess... I, I'm just gonna knock off whatever he brings in. Unless he brings in the Salamence, in which case I'll probably just Stone Edge it. If he brings in Salamence, we Stone Edge. Anything else, we go for the knockoff. We don't want to click EQ in case, um... Check the double on the Salamence on it. Can go into Heat Ran. Yeah, we are not EQing here. We're going to click the knockoff. Remember, we're going to shoot up kill. Cool. He Shaka. Okay, cool. That's great. Gonna go and guard here. You can outspeed me. Um, we win now. We sack Mandibuzz here. We're gonna sack Mandibuzz, and we just win. As long as he doesn't have HP steal, we're good. We trick room here. We're gonna eat that. Trick room. That should be game. That should be game. That's good. That's great. Um I The only thing that comes to mind that really stops me here is like Salmon with the fairy berry, whatever that one's called. Really? Damn it, bro. I really wanted to sweep with Diancy. This could actually be a slight problem. Could be a problem. We're going to knock off. Going to sell elements here. Quick knock off again. off you can go and guard we get the boost we get one kill we get another kill on anything on his team because I can't imagine right could live you can go into this we're gonna knock off again okay he's gonna win yeah he's gonna win That's unfortunate, man. Ah, uh, exactly, fucking Kurt, dude. If I had Terrain Extender, fuck, man. That sucks. It also sucks. I thought Diancy would kill there. I could have sworn I ran the cow whenever I was calking or cropping that man or that. I just fucking killed with Diancy with a Moonblast. Like, it did like 80, 90%. Guard of War. Like, it sounded insane to me at the time. Like, but like, Cow said that I. Did 80%, 90%. Yeah, now it's only saying 60. What I I don't think I was calculating regular Gardevoir, was I? No, because it does the same either way. Why was I calculating where it said Moonblast was doing 90%? I don't know. But either way, he beats me here. Let's knock off. Damn, bro. Almost had silver. I can't ever seem to beat him. This was definitely a close one, though. If I exploded, if I exploded, ah, oh, I should have done the calc to make sure. I would have exploded, killed the Gardevoir, right? Gardevoir just died to an explosion. I would have had like two turns left. 
or I would have been, had one more turn of terrain because I wasted one. Yeah. Ah, oh, that sucks. I missed by I should have done the calcs. I just remember it saying like I did 80 or 90% with it. Which, like, even at the time that seemed ridiculous. Ah, oh, that sucks. Ah, oh, GG. Can HP ice me? Um. We're gonna go for ice beam freeze. Yeah, he's gonna thunderbolt us. If you don't get the freeze, we lose. And we lose. Ah, oh, that sucks, bro. GG. GG, silver. Uh, I should have done the calcs. I could have won that. Oh, well. G fucking G, silver. Well, that's game one of our three preseason games. Hopefully, the other two stay on Wi Fi. I may just fucking post calm those just to. Because NTR definitely makes the internet um, worse for um, like connection wise. Typically, I don't have a problem with it, but I may just post comment and not use NTR. So, um, and then just citra that. So that's probably what I end up doing. But yeah, we lost here. Luckily, it's just a preseason game. I really enjoyed the using this team just based off that. Um, we still got to face Austin and coach of the Lawrence Town Flames, and we got to face It's, It's Ya, or whatever, It's, and I don't even know his team name, but there are other two uh, games we have to play for the preseason, and then later in March, we will have our season one, or week one game versus John Jr. and the Portland Night Shaders, I believe, um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Good once again, GG to Silver. Make sure to check him out. His stuff will be in the description. He may be recording this. I really don't know. Maybe not the preseason game, but probably the regular season. Maybe the regular season. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. It's been Tony. I'm out. Peace.